Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel or welcome in if you are new. Today's gonna be another great video because I haven't done one of these in quite some time and we are in need of an updated q and I have a few new faces around here and I just want to let you guys know a little bit more about me. If you've been here a while, you probably can answer some of these questions for me because you've been watching my video videos for some time. But for her, all my new friends, let's get to know me a little bit better. I have 20 questions on here, so I'm going to try to move quickly through them so we're not here for for forever. But let's get started. Um, first question, my name, easy one. My name is Dream. I, I live in the North Dallas, Texas area. I am a married mama of two. I have two kiddos. I have a son who is 20 years old. He doesn't live at home anymore. He is in the Navy. And then I have a seven-year-old daughter. So um, we are actually transplants from California. We moved here about a year and a half ago. Um, we bought a home and well, it wasn't even a home yet. We bought so we bought like a lot and our home was built on it. But um, we like I said, we've been here a year and a half and we are absolutely loving it. Um, I back in California and for pretty much my whole life, I've worked in the field of education um, between being a teacher in a classroom or and being in administration. But when we moved to Texas, we made a decision as a family that I would stay home and I'm actually loving it. So I'm loving being able to run my daughter to all her different activities and just being able to able to volunteer in her classroom and be involved. So loving all of that. Um, your favorite part of where we lived well we lived like outside of the city and i love it because we have like we can get to the city um you know kind of easily um and but we live in like a smaller filled town with um like i love my daughter's school i love the sense of community where we live i love the more country feel like i take my daughter to school and we have like cows outside and stuff like that so i love all of that those things are my vibe that brings me to one of the other questions it's like are you a city person or a uh, like a small a country girl and I will say it's funny because I was born in Brooklyn New York but I am definitely like I am not a city girl anymore like it is not my vibe I the older I get to I just want simplicity quiet and just like a slower pace of life so the more country feel is definitely in the direction that I'm going into or more my vibe that I like. Um, is your home your dream home? Um, we, I love our home, like the finishes for our home. Um, I love our, what we've done for our home. So I love it's fresh, it's new, it's all of those things. I don't know if I necessarily believe in a dream home, but I will say, like I love our home, but it's probably not our forever home. Um, even when we bought it, we said we'd be here for like three to five years and then we'll reevaluate things and see what kind of, you know, different areas that we want to live in. We do know we want a bit more land, not a ton of land, um, but just a bit more space to stretch our arms, stretch our legs, and do all that fun stuff. So we, at next home, we'll have a bit more space, um, like acre or a little bit more, not a ton. And then um, that's kind of on our like bucket list for our next property that we purchase. Okay. Um, what's your um, channel about so I love doing YouTube it's like my hobby especially now that I'm a stay-at-home mom I can put like while uh, my daughter's in school I can put more like emphasis and you know focus more on my videos so um, my channel is about I post once a week um, every Tuesday you can expect to have a new video from me unless I do take moments off like breaks like when summertime comes I take like a week or two off right before school starts because everybody needs a break um, but 
Besides that, I consistently um, upload videos every single Tuesday. And my videos are usually about the things that I love. And I like that about my channel. I just post what I like. So I like home decor. I love um, styling our home for the different holidays, making holidays special. My Instagram is along with that too. Um, making things special like curating a library for my daughter that goes along with the different seasons like I love those things so a lot of seasonal decor decorating videos um, hauls as well like my favorite um, home decor items and then I do sprinkle in um, clothing items too like what I bought my daughter so you guys can get like a video that's coming up is like a huge spring um, haul for a little girl so that'll be up soon and then I like to sprinkle in some fashion stuff for me as well so my channel is pretty much the things that I love so that really centers around home decor things I do in my home our favorite things um, I like to share I've been a mama for a while so if I can help anybody else then I am all for that so love that Okay, let's dive into some lighthearted, fun ones. Current favorite TV show, I will have to say I have two. So if I'm watching alone, I'm re-watching Monk on Netflix. I saw it years and years and years ago. There's about eight seasons. I think I'm on season two now, but I'm re-watching it and loving it. I haven't seen it in years, but it was my favorite Back in the day, me and my brother, um, it was one of his favorite shows too. So yeah, I'm re-watching that. It's just nostalgic for me. And then with my husband, we're actually watching Invasion on Netflix. I don't think it's a new show. It's an older one, but it's really good and we love it. Um, kind of, you know, into the world stuff. Um, but really love it and it's we watch that when he gets home from work after eating dinner and all that stuff we usually try to sneak in an episode or two before we go to bed um, good shows you have recently watched well Netflix had a ton um, oh, Griselda I thought I watched that with my husband we thought it was really really good and then we watched fool me once and I thought that was really really good as well so Griselda is a movie and then The Fool Me Once is a show. They're both on Netflix, but those were those were pretty good. Um, next question. Uh, worst movie, best movie you recently watched? I don't know about you guys, but I feel like since the, you know, 2020, the movies when everything like closed down, the movies that come out are the quantity or quality both of movies that come out just are not the same pre-2020 so um we used to go to the movies all the time especially when my son was smaller we would go all the time but since 2020 I don't feel like the movies that come out are they're few and far between that are great the last one we saw in theaters was Wish and that was over like Christmas New Year's break I saw that with my daughter and she thought it was really cute um but I don't watch I I'm trying to think before that was the last one the Mario movie or something I feel like they're few and far between now especially like kid flick movies I know that Moana is this Moana 2 is coming out in November which my daughter is really excited to see but yeah I don't in the movies, the last one would be that Wish movie. And I know it didn't get like tons of praise and maybe didn't do as well as Disney wanted, but we thought it was cute and sweet. Um, the worst movie that I've seen recently, and you guys don't come for me, and I know people are going to do I This movie won an Oscar or a couple Oscars. I don't even know. But I didn't really love the Barbie movie. I watched it at home. I watched it with my husband who did not like it. He thought it was like so cheesy. Um, but I usually like a little cheese. Um, but me and him just watched it together. So he was like wasn't feeling it and I usually don't mind a little cheese like one of my favorite movies of all time is Legally Blonde so you know I like a little cheese but 
I didn't really love it. I don't know why. So, didn't really love it. The Barbie movie. I'm sorry, guys. Um, my favorite color. I always say blue, and I am wearing blue jeans. But I like pinks as well, too. Um, but I probably would still say blue. Blue, I love white, which is an absence of color, so it's not even a color. But, um, yeah, blue, I guess. Uh, celebrity crush, still the same celebrity crush I've had forever. And we were actually talking on Super Bowl Sunday. I am actually, I'm filming this after, um, the, I'm filming this on Valentine's Day. So happy Valentine's Day, guys. Um, but I was talking with one of my girlfriends who we were talking about celebrity crushes and I said Chris Evans and she's like, that's random. I was like is it random but yeah Chris Evans has been my celebrity crush for quite some time so Captain America I think he's so cute okay next question coffee or tea a weird fact about me I do not drink coffee at all I think I tried a sip when I was many 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 years ago and I didn't like it my husband makes coffee every day I just don't like it um I never drink it, so tea would be 100% since I've only tried coffee once many years ago and don't drink it. Um, pets, we do not currently have any pets and this may come off as bad too. I just, I we had a dog, um, his name was Tiger, he passed about five years ago and I was such a dog mom I loved I loved our dog he was so cute he was a teacup Yorkie um but I don't have any desire to have any more pets it's just a lot it's like having another child or and I just all the things that come with having a pet I'm just we're me and my husband were like no we're good we're good with having any more pets um, morning or night person. I am a hundred percent a morning person. Um, I wake up, I'm like chipper and cheery and remember I don't drink coffee. Um, and I'm ready to start my day. So definitely a morning person. And then the last question, just very random. Do you like dress up? I do. I've always had a love of clothing and fashion. Just like I like to style my home, I like to style myself too and style my daughter. So yes, I love, you know, having dresses. I don't dress up now that I'm a stay-at-home mom. I feel like I don't dress up as much, but I do enjoy when we're going out, you know, dressing up a bit. But that is it. I hope you guys got to learn a little bit about me. If you have any more questions, put those down in the comment box below and I'll make sure to answer them. I want to thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. That really helps out my channel and I will see you guys very soon with a whole new one.